Although it was a risk to cast someone unknown as one of the series' leads, it turned out to be massive for Game of Thrones. The emerging actress is a novice to Hollywood, despite having previously played gigs on Australian TV. A few years ago, she washed dishes at a restaurant to make ends meet. However, Millie is already the face of House of the Dragon, appearing on the show's promotional materials. Her outstanding performance as the steely Rhaenyra is predicted to make her a household name. Welcome back, everyone! In today's video, we'll be telling you all about Millie Alcock. Everything you need to know about Millie, from her previous work in television and film, to her recent discovery of photography, will be discussed today. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Let's begin! The House Targaryen is the focus of the epic fantasy spin-off set 200 years before the events of Game of Thrones. Australian actress Millie Alcock portrays the young Princess Rhaenyra Targaryen. Millie Alcock started acting as a young girl. Amelia May Alcock was born on April 11, 2000, and she and her two brothers were reared by her parents in Sydney, Australia. Young struck by the acting bug, Millie made her theatrical debut at six in a Little Red Rocking Hood presentation at her neighborhood church theater. She wore a denim skirt and cowboy boots. The actor said her interest in narrative began even earlier, after repeatedly clicking the rewind button on a stolen blockbuster DVD of the Audrey Hepburn classic Breakfast at Tiffany's. In an interview with the American fashion publication Flaunt, she made her small screen debut in Australia. 2014. Millie made her television debut in a small role in the romantic comedy Wonderland. Soon after, she was cast in roles in other Australian programs, including that of Isabella Barrett in High Life and Cindy Jackson in the third season of Janet King. The BF Chefs, which Millie also hosted and aired on the Disney Channel and was shot in Sydney, was filmed there. The actress's resume lists several TV commercials for well-known companies, like Cadbury, KFC, and Woolworths. Millie is also a movie star, having appeared in The School, Reckoning, and The Gloaming. She quit school to pursue her dream career. When Millie was chosen to star with renowned comic Tim Minchin as the runaway adolescent Meg in the Australian drama Upright, she was a Year 12 student at Sydney's Newton High School of the Performing Arts. Millie decided to drop out of school to focus on her acting career, due to the demands of the filming schedule. She won the 2018 Casting Guild of Australia Rising Star Award for her depiction of Misfit Meg in the eight-part series. So the risk paid off. In an interview with Miss Vogue Australia, Millie acknowledged that she has no regrets, saying, I knew that this opportunity would be so much more of a user experience than earning my piece of paper. No, this is what I've been working toward, and I've been given this incredible opportunity with this amazing cast, with this beautiful script." I responded. Upright has been broadcast in the UK, Canada, and Australia, and in March 2022, Millie traveled to Queensland to film the second season. She formerly resided in her mother's attic. Although Millie is now a resident of London, not long ago, she was residing in the attic of her mother's home in Australia. She had accepted a job washing dishes in a restaurant to supplement her acting income while she was between gigs. She also submitted two self-tapes for an unknown HBO project. In just two weeks, Millie received a call from her agent, informing her she had been offered the coveted part of Princess Rhaenyra Targaryen in the HBO series House of the Dragon. I never imagined this would happen to me, Millie remarked in an interview with Stellar Magazine at that crucial time. I froze and asked my companion, do you have wine? After taking a long breath, I then called my mother. She bonded with her House of the Dragon co-star. Millie had to move from her family's Sydney home to a flat in Primrose Hill for the filming of House of the Dragon which was a valid baptism of fire for her. Amid a worldwide pandemic, living alone for the first time, and working on a large-scale production, Millie acknowledged that she felt out of her element and needed the help of her cast and crew. She grew close to her co-star Emily Carey, who plays Alicent Hightower. In an interview with Hype, Millie said, We virtually met before the event. 
and both shared the same feelings about this job. We grew close because we are both young ladies working on a popular show, often centered around guys. I adore Emily, consider her a little sister, and I am fiercely protective of her. Aww, isn't that cute? She's a pro at riding a pretend dragon. As the show's name implies, Princess Rhaenyra, played by Millie, is a dragon rider. In the series' framework, Rhaenyra treats Cyrax, her steed, as if it were a pet. Cyrax is modeled after an eagle. The fact that Cyrax is an optical illusion made Millie engage with a fake blue screen quite a bit, which she found entertaining. The actress discussed writing Cyrax while addressing fans at San Diego Comic Con 2022. Millie said that you're perched atop what appears to be a mechanical bull that one might ride at a bar or pub. It raises six feet into the air, and four men use leaf blowers. Weird. She's a keen photographer. Millie's primary hobby is acting right now, but she also has a knack for photography. During the lockdown, she began her new pastime, and she has shared a few of her chic photos on Instagram. A black and white photograph of young Parisians playing ball in the streets sticks out among the others. According to Millie, the picture she took is stunning. In a flaunt interview, she said, Some people could look at the shot of the kids in Paris and think, Oh, the composition is wrong. It's touch tilted. Because it's alive. I believe beauty is in imperfections. It appealed to me because it can direct a picture and arouse a specific emotion. Let's now talk about what she thinks of her role. She also disclosed to Wonderland that she had relocated from Sydney to England after learning she had been cast as the younger Rhaenyra in House of the Dragon. It was a big change, but I just told myself, okay, for whatever reason, they believe in me, so I have to believe in myself. She said, I tried not to let myself become consumed with all the frills and fluff of what could happen after the show, because whatever I did was going to be on screens forever. So I wanted to put down the best performance I could, she added. We are in awe with her character. What are your views on her character? Do let us know in the comment section below. We'll be back real soon with another informative video just for you. Don't forget to like and share this one if you enjoyed it. We'll see you all very soon.